For one day only, Soldier Field will transform from the home of the Bears to the home of the Beers. See what I did there? The Chicago Beer Classic takes over Soldier Field this weekend with over 70 breweries showcasing their brews. And we've got Katie Notariani here to chat all things beer. Hello and good morning. Good morning. I'm super excited that you're here for obvious reasons. Thank you. <laughs> so this is supposed to be a big deal. What can people expect at the fest? They can expect um, 75 different breweries and 150 beers. They'll have two each there. Um, there's two sessions, one at 11.30 and 4.30, which will be great because it's going to be a nice day um, throughout the entire day. Um, there'll also be games, pretzel, necklace making. Um, if you want to pay a pretzel little bit extra. Pretzel, necklace making. Yes. <laughs> um, you can also do stadium <laughs> tours while you're there. and. Um, you know, you get a chance to drink some beers out on the field instead of being in the stands for once. It's so funny. I see you guys brought all of the drinking games we did in college to Soldier Field. Yes. That's all that we asked. <laughs> so lots of choices from the Chicagoland area in yes. terms of beer. Yep. Um, so to start, we actually have um, Noon Whistle here. here. Okay. Um, so which one is this? Tell me about it. This I'm is smell it. <laughs> this is um, a peach beer. It's um, oh, wow. wheat beer with peach and um, Fun fact about the brewery is that he, the brewmaster actually used to vacation mm. in Marquette, Wisconsin, and there they have a whistle that blows at noon every day, which mm -hmm. signifies when to crack open your first beer. So <laughs> that's why they call it noon whistle, and they actually do it today at the brewery as well, every day. Nice. Noon. Mm -hmm. Okay, citrusy, tart, yeah. fruity. That's what we want for sure. Yeah. I learned so I learned to like beer, craft beer specifically, yeah. just because there. Once you know a little bit about how to how it tastes and what mm -hmm. you like and what you don't like, it makes the experience way better. So any of those people. Out there who are not sure about beer like maybe look a few things up online or take a few tasting courses yeah some things that help tell me about this one so um, this is our charlatan pale ale this is from the maplewood brewery which is um, actually just opens its first brew pub in logan square recently mm. um, it's a classic pale ale it's got citrus undertones but it also has a lot of tropical flavors like um, passion fruit and mango mixed with it as well oh, okay yeah. this beer hoppier for sure mm -hmm. for sure i gotta get me a little pretzel here just yep, cleanse the palate a little bit you have them yes yes, yes. hey See, these people know what they're doing. <laughs> Tell me about this one, Sam 76. So Sam Adams, that's a familiar brewery for sure. Yes, this is one of our national ones that we have here. Um, and this is one of their um, craft SKUs that they have. And um, they tried mixing it up a little bit by mixing their lager with um, an ale yeast. And mm -hmm. that way they have the fruity flavors of an ale, but also the smooth drinkability of a lager mixed together. Okay, let's get this last one in. I just yeah. love that that one, that one is really smooth actually. Mm -hmm. Tell me about this one. Yeah, so this is Finch. This is another pale ale kind of wheat beer. It's called Sungasm, mm -hmm. um, and it's got a lot of lemon flavors to it, which is great for a day like today where it's going to be really hot. Oh, I love you're it. drinking a beer out on a patio and mm -hmm. being in the sun. Uh, first one and last one, my faves, yes. for sure. Okay, you guys, all of these beers, they're going to be out there and so much more. The Chicago Beer Classic is happening Saturday, May 5th at Soldier Field. ChicagoBeerClassic.com is where you can find all the ticket information.